science fiction has seeped into science reality this week, as a robotics company showed off its sniper rifle-equipped RoboDog at the Association of the U.S. Army's annual convention in Washington, D.C. Sure, the Quadrup robot might resemble a good boy, but it's packing a built-in sniper rifle capable of engaging targets from three-quarters of a mile away. The service could operate this robotic weapon system remotely. Importantly, it would only engage targets with permission from a human being. This RoboDog, known as Vision 60, comes from Philadelphia-based Ghost Robotics, a startup focused on legged robots. Previously, we spotted Vision 60 robots in U.S. military service during a 2020 U.S. Air Force exercise at Nellis Air Force Base in Nevada. There, the machines help to establish a security cordon, air bases, which often require runways that are thousands of feet long, can be difficult to patrol effectively, and the robo-dogs make it easier to rely on fewer humans for the job. This new, armed version of the Vision 60 is equipped with the special purpose unmanned rifle, Spur. It's a 10-shot rifle chambered in a 6.5mm Creedmoor, a new, medium caliber, high-velocity, long-range precision round. The Creedmoor is known in shooting circles for having a relatively flat ballistic trajectory, making it more of a hit what you see round at longer ranges than older cartridges like the DOT 308 Winchester. The robot's human controller is in charge of Spur, a 30x electro optical thermal scope, assists in the weapon's target acquisition and aiming. The Vision 60 looks a lot like Spot, the internet famous Robo Dog from Waltham. Massachusetts-based Boston Dynamics. Both Quadrup robots were involved in the September 2020 exercise at Nellis Air Force Base. The similarities don't stop there, either. Both can climb staircases, navigate complicated terrain, and right themselves if they fall over. Mission 60 and Spot each have a maximum payload of 31 pounds. The two robots have the same top speed of 5.24 feet per second, but Ghost Robotics claims Vision 60 will eventually gain the ability to sprint at 9.84 feet per second, or 6.71 miles per hour. Vision 60 is capable of remote-controlled or autonomous operation. In remote-controlled mode, a human operator would select a target and then open fire. However, current U.S. military policy on autonomous systems prohibits automatic target engagement. 